what's up and welcome back to my channel now today I'm going to be talking about the upcoming Sideshow Collectibles the good the bad and the ugly Clint Eastwood's the man with no name figure so basically we are getting a figure based on Clint Eastwood and the Spaghetti Westerns trilogy you know like the uh, the man with no name the character that he played we're getting a, car a figure based on that particular version of uh, from the uh, first film the good the bad and the ugly from that particular film now I think that is exciting now this is part of the uh the Clint Eastwood Legacy Collection that they have going on. I already had knew about these. I just was waiting for them to actually have fully revealed them because I already knew that they had this Clint Eastwood Collection that they're from the brand guy and they finally have opened them. Because within these pictures, if you actually go through all the pictures, say if you like on I think Toy Arc or like a Sideshow Collectibles, you can even set like a tease for the third, the Dirty Harry figure. That now that's the one I prefer. I was like a huge fan. Well, I am a huge fan of Dirty Harry. Mostly like the first film. You know, I didn't really get into like the other ones that much. It was just mostly like the first one. So that's the one I definitely would like to see. But I must admit now, being that this is from Sideshow Collectibles, I think the likeness to Clint Eastwood or the Man from Name looks it looks pretty good. It is better than I thought it would actually be. I think they're doing like a good job on the likeness of it. Now he comes with a uh, well, he'll stand like he's a six scale figure, and he stands where well, he stands 12 inches tall, six scale figure. He will include a rock, a pistol, a rifle, multiple interchangeable hands, and like a fabric outfit, too, as well. It looks pretty good, though. Now, they have this schedule to be released this year, too. I think it's between uh, October and, um, yeah, it's scheduled to be uh, shipped out in this year between like October and uh, December of uh, this year 22 so it's, it's kind of close when you think about because you know usually when they announce a lot of these figures we have to wait like a whole year then they keep getting delayed and pushed back and all that all that kind of stuff but yeah i must admit this looks pretty good though i'm surprised being that you know like sideshow collectibles like like their figures are good but when they're actually trying to do like uh like uh say like human based like like characters or figures like their faces a lot of times it, be, it doesn't really look too good but like I said, if you check some of the pictures, there's also a hint of like the dirty hair figure, and that one looks definitely good. Even that one looks like Clint Eastwood. But even the man with no name does look like Clint Eastwood, like his face. So I think they got a good job, doing a good job there. Now one of the things I noticed about like his cigar, it's like it's stuck in his mouth too. Like he has like a cigar in his mouth. So I don't think you can remove it or anything, like it's just stuck there. But it does look like Clint Eastwood though. So yeah, I'm just excited about this. So this is the upcoming Sideshow Collectibles. The good, the bad, and the ugly. The man with no name. Six scale figure. I'm definitely excited about this. I will be picking this one up. Please leave a comment and uh, subscribe too as well.